Hello guys, uh, today we are going to discuss on the significance of objective resolution in constitutional development of Pakistan. Uh, that is uh, how constitution or sorry how the objective resolution is vital in the constitutional development of Pakistan. This resolution was passed in 1949 and this was passed to provide a base for the constitution making in Pakistan. That is it was a framework this objective resolution was a framework and it stated that what type of constitution will be made in Pakistan first this uh, objective resolution provide an ascent of the sovereignty of God the sovereignty of God is a basic concept of Islam and this objective resolution clearly stated that in Pakistan sovereignty belongs to God and next this uh, resolution provide compliance of Islamic rules and regulations that is this resolution protect the Islamic rules and regulations in Pakistan because according to this resolution uh, no law shall be made in Pakistan which is repugnant to Islam so this resolution protect the Islamic rules and this resolution provide an Islamic system this resolution was inserted as a preamble in all three constitutions in 1956 when our first constitution was made this objective resolution was inserted in the preamble of the constitution and later on when 19 in 1962 the second constitution was made again this was inserted as in the preamble of the constitution and in 1973 as well in the originally uh, the on the original constitution of 1973 the objective resolution was inserted as the preamble of the constitution preamble of the constitution is not the regular part of the constitution but it provides a it it's this uh, you can say that the preamble is the summary of the entire constitution it stated that what type of the constitution is later on in 1985 when it was observed that since the objective resolution is a very important resolution and this must be regular part of the constitution so in 1985 during Zia period under the 8th amendment this resolution was made as the permanent part of the constitution under article 2a of the constitution of 1973 so now the objective resolution is regular part of the constitution under article 2a of the constitution of 1973 this objective resolution provide rule of justice as this uh, resolution ensure the justice system in Pakistan and it's clearly stated that uh, ju uh, judiciary must be free from all constraints it must be free from the uh, free from constraints from uh, any constraint from administration so justice system must be free and fair in Pakistan so this objective resolution provide rule of justice in Pakistan and this constitution protect the rights of minorities as in this uh, objective resolution it's clearly stated that uh, all minorities shall be free to profess their religion and practice their own culture system so this objective resolution protect the security of or security of rights of minorities and the objective resolution is the separate of the constitution because entire constitution revolves around the objective resolution this uh, objective resolution provides a base and the entire system uh, sorry entire constitution is based on the objective resolution as the objective resolution clearly stated the sovereignty of God and no uh, no uh, any article or no law shall be made against the sovereignty of God and against the Islamic system against the minorities rights and against the Islamic democratic system 
so this objective resolution is the separate of the entire constitution an objective resolution protects the basic human rights as uh, the, uh, according to the objective resolution it has been made the duty of state to protect hu basic human rights so objective resolution uh, provides protection of basic human rights now guys your home task is what is preamble of the constitution either it is the regular part or not if it is not the regular part of the constitution then why a preamble must be inserted in constitution thank you for joining take care goodbye